Hello, my dear uh, global family. So welcome, everyone, especially you who joined here online and those who join offline watching this video and sharing this uh, message to billions. Um, we meeting daily with one purpose, to live in peace and finish Ultimate Global Peace by 2027 and Global Peace Forum. Uh, you know, uh, there was many, many, many different things in the history. Uh, and now in the last days, we see so many struggles and there is a thousands of questions and fears and the, everything. And everything we could, uh, all eight billions people, all global family, all God's family, God's children could overcome it with today's topic, true love. This is uh, how we could attract true love in our family community country in the world, uh, because till now, uh, yes, uh, uh, human beings was trying to live in love, uh, but uh, as Jesus described, so great love even to love your own enemy, and this is so, uh, so good, you know, so, so, sometimes you, you may think, uh, therefore, people are divorcing because they don't find love in their family, and they uh, and uh, they could, uh, couldn't love themselves uh, <laughs> in the difficulties. And uh, the whole world is like this, and therefore start wars. And uh, to glue it, everything, uh, because the, the whole world is like a museum without love. It's just, you know, like some physical, you know, like <laughs> on the shelves. <laughs> and the only true love of God could glue everything uh, really clear and tight and fix all the wounds historical that we see nowadays uh, everybody all of these leaders uh, uh, globally presidents they try to remember how difficult it was 100 years ago and all of this instead of thinking how to build substantial love and today tomorrow and every day for uh, five years 10 years 100 years and uh, thousands of years how to do everything with true love and we see those leaders who uh, have problems in the family, as more they suffer in the family or even they are divorced, as more their country are suffering, unfortunately. So first task is to have a strong family, strong family and true love. Only there you could uh, raise the love. And uh, from the uh, religious science, is that after our life, when we grow, you know, you everybody of us like to go to their grandparents because they, they prepare their heart and they have so big love, they are ready to go to the heavenly kingdom, to the spiritual world. And this is how naturally God prepare every human being to raise their children, then they, they grow and, and they marry and they raise love, have their own children. And after they have grandchildren, and there is even more heart. And this is how love is growing and growing and growing until uh, ready to go to spiritual world because there is everything like instantly. You think about something and if you think about love, everything is ready, everything is prepared, everything is uh, done. And if you think other things, uh, especially if people are thinking about evil things, they are in hell automatically. So this is uh, uh, religious science and you couldn't change anything. Just raise love in your family, community, country, the world. And, uh, and now as we live in the science of coming time, you know there is a secret. Uh, you could receive true love from God through the, his messenger, only God's son, only God's daughter, uh, the God sent to nowadays to build heavenly kingdom and they finish heavenly kingdom just we supposed to inherit this heavenly kingdom based on true love and true peace in our life and our family community country the world and rejoice this okay so um, let's rejoice together with powerful music powerful quotes from the um, words of god from messiah and coming uh, subscribe the channel share this message to billions and uh, let's really rejoice together everything uh, what God sent to us uh, globally as we are here uh, from every corner of the world. Uh, let's uh, sing along uh, with karaoke. No.
Okay, okay, okay. This was the powerful music. Praise God. Let's go the messiah and coming words. Words of God from the philosophy of peace, and uh, he's talking he about uh, uh, if the Koreas unite, uh, the whole world unites because uh, they represent uh, all of these uh, two parties, uh, like materialism and idealism in the world. So let's uh, read a bit. Korea is divided at the, the 38th parallel into an able nation and K nation. Unless North Korea, which is the current position, voluntarily surrendered to the North South Korea, in the able position, the world of peace will not come. Today, world is div with the today world as a whole is divided into democratic and communist campus. And the Korean Peninsula is the front line between these two blocks. The reform the unification of Korea will serve as a model for world unification. If Korea is to be a nation that the world welcomes, uh, the Koreans must become a people who willingly take the lead by shouldering the cross of the world. Koreans have to be willing to sacrifice their nation and its sovereignty to the sake of the world. The kingdom of peace will be built on the victorious foundation of the cross. On that day, the nation that carried the world's cross will be granted a position of glory. Okay, this was uh, quotes for today. Let's think about uh, what God was to say, want to say uh, to us. And uh, let's uh, go with our global prayer chain and invite uh, Irina from Uganda uh, to say a powerful prayer for peace. Uh, as today's topic is uh, attract love, uh, let's uh, rejoice uh, with God together and uh, invite God uh, uh, to our life uh, as he is the source of love and peace. Okay, happy welcome, Irina. Can you pray now? Oh, Irina. Hello. Yeah, yeah, hello, hello. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, yeah. We can hear you. I, I can pray. Yeah, I can hear you. Please pray. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, today's topic is good because we know that God is love and we have to love him because he first loved us. Let us pray. Good evening, our most precious heavenly parents, our God. Good evening. Our beloved two parents, or heaven and earth, and all humankind. Good evening, our beloved Jesus Christ, and all the saints of the that came on earth here to educate us about God. We thank you so much for this evening. Thank you, heavenly parents, for life that you give us every day. Thank you that you take care of us every single minute of the day. We are very grateful, and we. We will always live a life of gratitude, knowing that you, because you are a God of love, you will always love us. Please forgive us our sins. We know that when we sin, we make you unhappy. And we know that when we sin, your heart pours out crying because you lose your children as you lost your children in the Garden of Eden again. So we are really sorry that we hurt you. We are really sorry that we don't understand you. We are really sorry that we don't know how to return your love for us to you. We only hope that every day, as we come to understand you better, we can learn to get closer to you, our heavenly parents. Thank you so much, because heavenly parents, Every evening we come here to pray for peace. We know that ultimate peace is the that will connect us to you in love. So we pray that, Father, peace can happen before the year 2027. So we pray for everything that is deciding the peace to stop so that we may be able to go back on the right track, follow that track, until we learn how to live for each other, until we learn how to pray for good things only, until we learn to keep our families intact, 
because we've understood how important family is in your providence. Thank you for my brothers and sisters on this forum, those who come live and those who pray online. I really want to thank you for their time that they dedicate to pray for peace every day. I want to pray and report as Enel Tanji of the Blessed Center of the Family. Amen, 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 adieu, adieu, adieu. Amen, and adieu, so amen. good amen. to hear from you. Uh, how you speak with the uh, heavenly parent. Uh, uh, Selena, happy welcome. Please say a powerful prayer. Yeah, I'm praying for families and yes. victims. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you for the powerful prayers from our sister Elena. We bless the Lord that we are here today by his grace. By his grace that we are here. I'm praying for families, victims in the war front. Families that are going through a lot. Let's pray. Father God, we come boldly before your throne of grace to say thank you for bringing us this far. We lift our most heartfelt praise, oh God, for those who on this day are still waiting for, for word of thy loved ones. And for those who have already heard the worst, we pray for those who are healing from injuries to body or mind. We pray for those still uncounted for a lot of people are gone, Father. We pray, we pray for those who have never been in battle, but who have witnessed wars, ravages, even the survivors, Lord, have become... <clears throat> Lord, have become victims. And although it is but, your, but by your grace that we come here to pray, we too mourn as we mourn for others, our own innocence lost. Oh, Lord, we do not delight in wickedness. Oh, God, so enfold us with your compassion. Uphold us with your love and keep us and all who suffer in your sight. Grace us, O oh God, heal and embrace us and lead us from this darkness into your everlasting light. In Jesus, much less, I pray for families. And I also pray for all of us on this line that may God protect us. Our going out and our coming in is the only one who can protect us. We pray that this year will be a year of um, wisdom and knowledge. If we don't have it, we will perish. We should grant us that as very Christians, we need to love at each other. We need God's protection. We thank you for doing that for us this year too. In Jesus' much less name we have prayed. Amen. 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 Amen, amen, amen. Thank you very much, Selena. So powerful prayer. Yeah, so good to hear how you speak with the Heavenly Parent and uh, really feel how you speak with God. Real communication, live. <laughs> Built by many, many years of devotion. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, uh, please uh, join my prayer too. Uh, dear Heavenly Parent, we are so happy and uh, tremendous uh, grateful that you... Uh, join us here together across the globe. Uh, dear Heavenly Parent, uh, um, as you inspire us to pray for all your children, you ask us the Bible to pray for the sick, and we see how much uh, our brothers and sisters are suffering. We see it in the news, we see it in the neighborhood, we see it everywhere. And the, 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 there are so many calamities and difficulties and even the wars. Uh, even right now, uh, as uh, you raise your children from stone age, from uh, eye to eye, uh, to this uh, level of global brotherhood, but still uh, the, 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 this uh, evil force uh, is attacking our brothers and sisters, especially those in power, uh, they are attacking so much that they start war right now. And there is a big wound in this uh, big human body of 8 billion cells, of 8 billion uh, of children in Eastern Europe and, uh, and, uh, and um, 
uh, Middle East, dear Heavenly Parent, we pray right now. Please uh, uh, help, uh, really let your prophecy of uh, the visions and dreams came to our brothers and sisters and power. Everybody, all eight billion people uh, is uh, destined to, to live in peace by 2027 and today technology even by 2025. It's just uh, one simple step. Every one of us supposed to uh, start peace with us, raise the flag of peace. And uh, uh, when all 8 billion plus people will raise flag of peace, then will be peace. That means that they will, they, will, uh, they will say no to evil influence that is coming, attacking every human mind. And uh, they say yes to God's love that is uh, right now, Open by the Messiah's and coming is like high noon uh, shining on us, and uh, is era of direct dominion of God, 12th year uh, without any trace of sin. is just start, and we supposed just to inherit it in our life, in our family, community, country, the world. Let we let this uh, you true love that is uh, shining to the world uh, vanish away all of these uh, uh, sins, dear Heavenly Parent, love of marriage, corruption, and stealing, and wars of. Uh, fighting, killing, all of this supposed to be uh, warnish away for forever. Immediately, dear Heavenly Parent, uh, from the uh, weapons uh, uh, to build, to, to build, to make uh, luxuries, dear Heavenly Parent, uh, let it be right now. It just, it just, uh, it, this is tremendous importance that uh, we really be homo sapiens, really wise, wise children of you that we don't, we say, we will say, not uh, like our ancestors in the Garden of Eden, they, they say yes to Satan, we say no. We say no to wars, no to weapons, no to all of this enmity that is um, uh, like, uh, uh, like a typhoon on the earth. Uh, but this, there is another even bigger typhoon of true love that is coming from the east and is shining on the world. And we suppose, as um, uh, Jesus said, to look at this uh, in the Moses time to the serpent and we will be alive. So now serpent is there. Uh, the Messiah's coming is there and let's look to it and let's uh, don't care about all of these serpents that are around. We supposed to, to see just one uh, central uh, God's true love through the Messiah's coming uh, through parents, only God's son, only God's daughter. And there's uh, this sustainization of the Holy Spirit already is uh, right here on earth. Uh, the, through mother, uh, with true father, they build it, uh, uh, the world of peace, and let me inherit it. And uh, for all it billions billion plus people on the earth, for all uh, you children, we till now was vagabonds, but uh, now we want to come back, and we are doing this day by day, hour by hour. This is substantialization as we are in 940th meeting a row. Just every evening we meet at 7 p.m. and uh, uh, pray for peace, and this is a global prayer chain that all the plus people are invited. When everybody will pray for peace, when everybody will invest their heart, when uh, everyone from simple people to presidents are welcome uh, to say this and envision peace and make plans for peace and really build it peace in their family, community, country, and the world. And most important, the families, strong families with true love uh, that they inherit from God they will build substantial peace. Dear Heavenly Parent, now is, uh, this is possible, uh, this realization of peace and uh, already is done, already start on earth and we feel it in this, in, in, in this substantial meeting that we are meeting here even we are meeting online uh, we could feel uh, god's love because god's love in 95 percent is addition for our and is energized and energize it every day every hour every second us uh, to really live for peace and build peace dear heavenly parent i pray right now uh, for all i plus people on the earth and as a representatives i pray for uh, Irina in uganda for amos and gabon and Selena and US, please, uh, and I'm in Europe, dear Heavenly Parent, please protect us as we invest all our heart uh, to our uh, brothers and sisters for their salvation, blessing, healing, through true love of God and the uh, marriage blessing, dear Heavenly Parent, please lead all of them, lead all of them, uh, dear Heavenly Parent, uh, save them, give them these ideas because uh, now that Jesus uh, said that uh, 
and the Bible that uh, uh, we are temples of God and uh, you live in us and in, 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 in each one of us and in many of us you are suffering because uh, of the sin we allow us, ourselves to sin sometimes uh, but enough is enough we don't want to sin anymore from today and every day every hour every second we want to do just goodness just live in true love uh, without any traces of sin and without any of these shadows without, without any of this uh, uh, impurities uh, please purify us and uh, us and our family community country and the world let it purify right now in this concrete moment dear heavenly parent um, um, please uh, lead us as we invest our heart uh, and protect us uh, really protect us and help us to find prepared people you prepared people like us globally uh, from the simple people to presidents all of them uh, as uh, there was at our meeting priests uh, bishops, archbishops, even the Pope, and also uh, the uh, all religious leaders, all politicians, uh, presidents, you bless them to be presidents just for one concrete uh, step to make peace 2027 in every corner of the world. You bless them with the money, billionaires, that they supposed to unite with Messiah's and coming, uh, and the uh, presidents, and religious leaders and all other scientists to unite with the um, uh, true parents, uh, only because of the son, only because of the daughter, uh, that you send the Messiah and coming uh, to build substantial peace by 2027 and even today's technology by 2025. Dear Heavenly Parent, please uh, lead us, all of us, to raise uh, funds to do your will. Help us to find how we could do it uh, uh, starting from today, uh, even more, how to accelerate it, how to how to invest our heart and help our brothers and sisters, save them from uh, uh, this uh, um, world uh, that uh, uh, if it's going, what is going uh, could perish, dear Heavenly Parent, with all of these atomic uh, threats and other, other different things. and. Uh, Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, you create this world even with more energy, just great universe, and even spiritual world, and what is even more greater, and atomic bombs is just uh, just nothing comparing with all of this energy that is uh, driving the the earth, the universe, and the, the galactics and everything, and let this true love uh, force, uh, power, and energy. Uh, came to us to purify us, purify all of us, dear Heavenly Parent. Please uh, receive this short report. Please help us uh, to reach our goals and uh, witness every day more brothers and sisters, witness them about the last days uh, of hope. And dear Heavenly Parent, please receive this short report, I pray. And my name is Nikolai Kirpala, Santa Plus family. Adieu, amen, amen, amen. Yeah, yeah, thank you very much, brothers and sisters. Everybody. So good to hear from you. So good to see you. When I see you, I see God. <laughs> uh, let's meet tomorrow. Please don't come yourself. He came with your neighbors, with your relatives, and even your enemies, if you have them. <laughs> I think nobody have, but who knows? <laughs> and uh, everybody, let them come from simple people to presidents. Uh, Bishop, Archbishop, uh, let them feel this true love of God that we feel here, this uh, communion, this union uh, that we have, and let this uh, vitalize and energize uh, tomorrow and after tomorrow as we prepare for Sunday, for a day of God, uh, to prepare and energize even more for all the week. Uh, thank you very much. Bye-bye. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Bye -bye. Same time, same place. Bye-bye, Selena. Bye-bye, Irina. Bye-bye, Amos. Bye-bye, yeah. everyone who watched this, who shared this. Yes, <laughs> all the best. Pray for you, stay happy, healthy. So good to see you. Yeah.